Yo, 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 how's it going, YouTube? It's your boy Lottie here bringing you another YouTube video, staying consistent with the consistent uploads, bringing you a short and sweet video just to make your day a little bit better. Happy Wednesday, guys. It is a very, very exciting day in the Call of Duty. Once again, it seems like every day is an exciting day, which is a beautiful thing. You know, there has been many times in Call of Duty history where it just has been a dry streak of no Call of Duty updates. But man, the scene is alive, it's booming, Warzone is popping, everything is so, so good in the Call of Duty scene. So this is the perfect time to bring you news. Call of Duty Black Ops, Cold War, is gonna get announced very very soon my prediction is it's gonna get announced next Tuesday June 2nd with the release of season 4 and why why do I think that here's why let me give you a couple pointers on why I think it is coming that soon first off we have seen leaks related to Warzone and supposedly a nuke is going to hit the Warzone map on Tuesday June 2nd it's gonna be a live event and it's gonna be absolutely amazing with this nuke Nukes are tied to the Cold War. That is what the Cold War was originally all about. The threat of a nuclear fallout throughout the entire world. Thank God it didn't happen because we wouldn't be here. You would not be listening to this voice. We would be trading bobble caps and fighting super mutants. If you get that joke, you're an absolute legend. So let's talk about a few leaks that have recently happened. A German game retailer has listed the title Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. So that pretty much set in stone our prediction that that will be the name of the new game so that is pretty much a hundred percent confirmed this usually happens every single year where we have a game retailer leaking the new call of duty and this happens for many many games i totally understand these game retailers didn't even list the game on their website but that was definitely an accident the game hasn't even been announced by anybody and man, it's been a long, long time. I feel like this is the longest it's been since a Call of Duty has been announced. I feel like all Call of Duties are already announced by this time with a little trailer or at least a title, a header, or some dev saying the name of the new COD. But just this just isn't the case this year. But that's absolutely fine. YouTubers and other people are prediction, predicting that if they announce the new Black Ops title, it will like remove all the hype from Modern Warfare, but I feel like that definitely wouldn't be the case. I feel like if anything, it would just add more hype and get people motivated to play the game. So I don't know why they're waiting. A very, very bad marketing scheme, in my opinion. You need to announce the new game to get people hyped and keep them playing this game so they stay competitive and continue to want to do good in your video game. Now let's hop into the second part. Why do I think this game is going to get announced very, very soon? We all know in my last video that a bunch of Call of Duty developers went dark on Twitter. They removed their headers, deleted a couple of tweets, and were being very, very suspicious. That has all changed last night. Vondahar is back. He is posting little, little snippets talking about his illustrations on his Twitter page. I'm going to throw a link in a conversation he had with a fan on his Twitter page. And also, he changed his header to a very, very snazzy picture of himself wearing a Call of Duty 2 Big Red 1 t-shirt, which is one of the original Call of Duty games that I played. My mom was like, I'm out to the club, take this COD game, enjoy yourself, little bro. I was like, thanks mom, you the freaking man, bro. My mom, love you moms, you out there, you started this Call of Duty obsession of mine, you are an absolute GOAT. But that's it, ladies and gents. That is why I think Call of Duty will be announced on June 2nd or around in that week time frame, maybe even alongside with the PS5. I know the PS5 was already announced, but they still haven't shown the physical con console and, you know, the whole marketing gimmick, the whole scheme. I'm assuming that this game will be a launch title due to the Black Ops name being a heavy hitter in the Call of Duty scene. Definitely one of the bigger Call of Duty titles. People love the Black Ops name. It just sells, just like the Modern Warfare name, big of the two top selling names because those were the original Call of Duty games and people have that nostalgia tied up in those names. That is why this will be probably one of the best selling CODs and also a new console release will be tied with these games. Usually when 
Call of Duties are tied to console releases and or the beginning of a generation, these titles tend to explode because everybody's buying a new console, everyone wants to buy new games, and usually there's only a select few games. So right now, Activision has all the stars aligned for them. Guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you drop a like, turn that bell notification on, drop a sub, drop a comment, tell your dad, tell your mom, tell your dog, tell your cat, tell everybody that Lottie is live and posting videos on a daily basis. We are turning this Call of Duty dream into a reality, baby. 111 subscribers with over 5,000 views. You guys are killing it. I love you guys. You're making me so hyped to bring these videos every single day. And pardon my voice, I just woke up from a 10-hour sleep.